A sister says, my husband is not good practicing Muslim, which might be because he was brought up in a family who were not staunch Muslims. When I call him towards this, uh, strengthening his deen, like praying on time and going to the masjid, he gets frustrated and reminds of the hadith where the Prophet said, والسلام, that most women will go to hell and calls me one of them. So who is right? Well, he is definitely wrong. He has no right to label someone that he is from the people of hellfire. The Prophet ﷺ gave a general description due to the characteristics of women in general, but not all. It's not for me or you to label people that they are from the people of hell. Secondly, it seems, sister, that your approach to your husband lacks diplomacy, lacks uh, um, wisdom. So you should rectify it. You should revise the way you speak to your husband because at the end of the day, it is not who is a winner and who is a loser. At the end of the day, you want to lead him to Jannah. You want him to accompany, to paradise, accompany you to paradise. But with this uh, 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 tug of war sort of relationship and who's stronger and who's weaker, who's right and who's wrong, it's a no man's game. And, and no one would win. Actually, both of you would lose. So you try to audit the way you give him da'wah, change it, uh, fine-tune it, and try to reach his heart so that, inshallah, both of you would reach Jannah.